Hello YouTube, we are going to do a quick chrono test here today of uh, a Gia 40 grain interceptor and this is the flat nose solid tip variety. You get much deeper penetration with these than the hollow points. But this is a competitor to the CCI Velocitor, which is uh, CCI's top, I guess you would say defensive or hunting 22 ammo. And uh, this stuff is actually chronoed significantly hotter than the CCI for me in all the tests I've done so far and tests a lot of the other channels have done. So we're going to try this out of two different barrel lengths. We have our 10.5 inch AR pistol. And then my neighbor was kind, kind enough to lend me his 16 inch Henry, which is his uh, side by side gun. Uh, he uses that for pest removal and varmint control. So. We're going to see what kind of losses we get out of them. The uh, Henry is a 16-inch barrel, and again, this uh, the AR is a 10.5-inch Faxon 1 and 8 twist barrel, uh, pencil barrel. So let's see what kind of velocities we get from these guys. Now, when I'm done shooting, I will average all of it out, and I'll figure out the energy foot-pounds, and I'll put that in the description, and then I'll pin it in the first post so that, you know... We could see what kind of power we're getting out of these guys. But let's do the AR first. Get this guy up here. And we have uh, six rounds that we're going to put down range here. That should be enough. Oh, man, I got a red wasp hanging out over here. Those guys are not very friendly. So if I start screaming like a girl, the red wasp got me. All right. So here we go. The Gila Interceptor Solid Point. 40 rounds, 10 or 40 grains, 10.5 inch barrel. Here we go. Error. Let's move back a little farther. 1320. 1316. Duplicate 1316. And an error. 1295. Right, we got one last round. Let's see if we can't get one more round downrange here. Give us a little bit better data. All right, here we go. Yeah, error. Was not meant to be, folks, but looks like we're going to be right around 1300 with that, which is good. That's solidly in the nine millimeter plus P uh, territory velocity wise, anyway. All right, now we're going to try the old Henry lever gun, the cowboy gun. Let's see what we get with this. Fourteen forty-four. That's cooking. Fourteen twenty-one. Fourteen oh three. Fourteen twenty-nine. Error. We got one more here. One more to go. 1423. Well, that was cooking. That's uh that's 357 magnum type velocity there. So that that's some pretty hot stuff. I would go, I would say that honestly, if you were a 22 for defense guy, self-defense or for small game hunting, that this Aguila Interceptor is definitely the way to go. 1,400 feet per second is cooking for a 40 grain bullet. And uh, I tested these earlier in my 4 inch SIG in another video that will be going up. And we were getting supersonic speeds out of a 4 inch gun with this. So that, that is very impressive. And then with our AR, we were in the uh, 1,300 range, which is still very impressive. So, I mean, honestly, I said that this was a. Uh, Similar to the CCI Velocitor, I was did a test, which is on my page. I'll post a link in the description below. And uh, we, from the 10-inch barrel, we weren't even averaging 1,200 feet per second. So we were averaging 1,300 plus from the 10.5 and over 14 from the 16. So that, that is very impressive velocity. And if you were going to use a 22 for defense, I think this is definitely the way to go. All right, folks, you all have a great day. I hope you enjoy yourself. Read them by me out.